vermiculite in and this is the coconut fiber that we were recommended to get. Okay, put a bit more of that in there. You can always add more. This is just a temporary home for now. And missed some of the sides and one part of the substrate. Because my little friend might be thirsty. So we're gonna do the unboxing. So thank you again, uh, Tarantulas Bristol. We've already had two Carabina Versicolor slings and one Avicularia um, species Pyro Purple and they're currently housed and doing really well. And this is the Gramostola Pulpra or the Brazilian Black Beauty and it's a sling as well. I'm excited. So the other slings were for my daughters, and of course now I'm totally obsessed as well, naturally. So we've got our peanut polystyrene well packaged again, as usual. Yeah, so this sling is for me because I just love the look of these tarantulas when they're fully grown. They're just so beautiful. Just unwrap the bubble wrap. Got my little net here. Gramostola pulpra. And the um, kitchen roll is lovely and damp like the last time. I'm not sure what the size was on this actually, I can't remember. So. just try and get a close-up my husband bless him is filming and he is arachnophobic so he's doing really well and there is my little beauty absolutely beautiful gorgeous absolutely gorgeous quite quiet so I'm just gonna take her gently and slowly and just place her onto the substrate and then she can just all out in her own time. Come on, little one. Oh, it's so lovely. You want to climb up? <laughs> there we go. Into your new little home. Gorgeous. So that is my new baby Grandma Stola Pulchra. Thank you very much, Tarantulas Bristol. Packaged wonderfully as usual and arriving safe and sound. So I will feed her in a, well, I keep saying her, but obviously we know we don't know that yet, but um, I'll feed her within a couple of days. And um, obviously I've misted up the sides as you saw in the preparation part. So there we go. I'm going to have two very excited daughters when they get home today.